The research that we do or participate in is ultimately aimed at trying to meet the needs of our customers to the best of our abilities. All right, perfect. Let's keep walking. Brady, do you have enough of the bags lying on the ground and stuff, too? Yeah. Okay. My name is Mac Earhart. I'm currently chairman of Albert Lee Seedhouse. I've worked here full-time for the last 34 years. I grew up in the family business. It was started by my grandfather in 1923, and my father ran it, and then my brother and I, and now it's run by a group of really great people, and we hired a new president and CEO about a year and a half ago. His name is Brett Bell. My role today is I've stepped back from sort of the day-to-day -day managing all the business activities, and instead I actually work in the business helping customers sometimes, and I spend a lot of time on product development and production of the seed that we sell. So today we're gonna to talk about some specific research that we're doing for corn, soybeans, and other crops, and also probably talk about some of the partnerships that we have with different private researchers and public researchers. The research that we do is all about bringing the best possible product to the farmer. And that means a lot of different things. It could mean trying to identify the highest yielding 104 day that works on sandy ground, or it could mean bringing a new variety of winter camelina out for the production of jet fuel, or it could also mean something in the cover crop world, maybe a winter barley that's more winter hardy than any of the winter barleys that have been released before. And all those are very specific end uses that different farmers will have. And so we're focused on trying to meet their needs in many different cases, whether it's for grain production, for cover cropping, or, or for fuel production. Have a great day. <laughs>